Hello? Hello, friends. I have a brand new pair of gloves for us to open together today. Huge thank you to the viewer who ordered these off of my ASMR Amazon wishlist. And this will be my first time to see them. You can see I just started the open tab, but I wanted to save the unboxing to do on camera with you all. I just got a glimpse. They look so cool. So all of my gloves up to this point have been shiny satin gloves, and these ones are a totally different material and texture that I'm very excited to try. Look at these. They're white. They're very long. And they have this like ruched pattern up the arms. Wow, that's so pretty. And big thank you to Jeff for sending these to me. Look at that. Okay, first thing I'm noticing, they're see-through, like kind of like a stretchy mesh. Look how stretchy that is. That's so cool. It almost reminds me of like a sea cucumber. Okay, so this one, it's all bunched up. Can you hear the sound of the fabric? So like with my other pairs of gloves, it comes with this cardboard hand inside. So it's white on both sides. This side is shiny. This, shine, this side is more matte. And wow, look how long these are. I'm so curious what these are going to look like on me. I think that white is also a really nice color for showing up on camera. Um, nice to do kind of a dark background or like more medium toned background and then have light gloves. Okay, let's get these on. Okay, you can see that it's stretchy, see-through mesh. It's really, really beautiful. Looks like it's going to fit well. Oh yeah, look at that. It fits my hand like literally perfectly. Let's see how far it goes up on my arms. Oh my gosh, look at that. That is so cool. Man, I love this textured side. I think I got this on Crooked. Look at that. That is so elegant. What does it sound like? kind of like these different folds and textures. It's like it fits comfortably but snugly and I really like that. Wow, that is so interesting and so beautiful. Let's get the other glove on. So you can see that the stretchy, like, I don't know what you call this part, but like it's gathered only on one side. I think it's gathered on like the outside of the glove. Yes. All right, and here is the second glove. So I think that I can kind of let it be very gathered all the way up like this, in which case it's a little bit shorter or it can be more stretched out and go all the way up my arms. Anyway, these are my new gloves and I think they're really cool. They feel good. 
big. I guess they're kind of nice for summer because they're not as warm as the satin gloves because they're like a see-through mesh material. Okay. I've cleared off my table and I just want to do some gentle table tracing. I wasn't sure how well the white gloves would show up on the white table, but I think the red lighting over there and the yellow lighting over there just adds some unique colors and shadows. Wow, I feel so elegant. I feel like my fingers can move really, really well. These are so, so comfortable. I'm not sure if you can hear what they sound like on the table. You can probably hear it a little bit. One thing that I like about having this new microphone is that I can set up my camera further away because the microphone cord is so long. Feel like a very elegant jellyfish or octopus. I don't know if there is such a thing, but that's kind of what I feel like. I just feel like I can do very smooth and graceful movements. I guess because I'm a little bit further away from the camera, that means I can't do quite as up close hand movements, but that's okay. I like how there's so much red light on this glove right now, and then this one looks almost white in comparison. When I get close, more red, further away, it's more of like a light pink. Okay, let's do some table tracing. I want you to keep your head still and follow my finger as it moves back and forth across your screen. Move towards the back of the table, over to the other side, down to the front. Very good. Now the other hand. I'm going to do some circles some little circles, some bigger circles, and now circles with both hands. Little circles, medium circles, and big circles. Very good. Very good. These are now in the running for the most comfortable pair of gloves that I own. I just think the texture is so unique and beautiful. I think this gathered edge is so pretty. You can see it on this arm really well. It's just so, so pretty. And I can really just adjust how far up I want it push it far up my arm or push it down a little bit more to make it more gathered and textured. I think that's just absolutely gorgeous. I just kind of happened to see these gloves on Amazon uh, maybe a month or two ago and I was like, wow, those look really interesting. And sure enough, they are very interesting and beautiful.
do some gentle table tapping. I'm going to start out with using my fingertips. I feel like I'm playing piano, but also like my fingers are little spiders dancing. Now let's try some fingernail tapping. That doesn't really work because there's so much fabric like gathered at the, the fingertips. So it doesn't actually sound that different from finger pad tapping. Ooh, scratching is nice. I think the fabric gives it a really nice, gentle sound. I'm digging through something, peeling back the top layer. What do you guys think of these gloves? They're not shiny which I know is one of the things that we love about the satin gloves, but they are really beautiful and interesting, at least in my opinion. So please let me know what you think. And if you have any ideas of how I could incorporate them into more videos in the future. And if there are specific colors or materials of gloves that you would like to see me add to my collection, feel free to leave comments below this video or any of my other videos. I read every comment, and so you're always welcome to leave your suggestions. I really like how the lighting looks more colorful as my hands get closer to the camera. It's very cool, but my arms are getting a little tired, so I'm gonna rest my elbows. Look at the pink and the white. Just those colors are so pretty and interesting. is as close as my hands can get to the camera, which I guess is pretty close, so that's good. Yeah, I definitely feel like a beautiful, elegant jellyfish, which again might sound like a bit of a contradiction, but I think jellyfish could absolutely be beautiful and elegant. Now, I don't actually like seeing jellyfish when I'm swimming in the ocean because I know that they can sting, but I do think they're very pretty when they are not in the water with me or when I'm not in the water with them. thinking that it would be helpful to get like a mic stand that like connects to my desk so the mic can be more like well yeah more off the desk and that way I have more access to the full table in front of me 
So if any of you have recommendations for inexpensive, I don't even know what it's called, mic clippy arms um, that can clip onto a desk, let me know. I did find one that I thought looked good and I added it to my Amazon ASMR list. But if you guys have one that you recommend, I would love to love to hear what you've used and enjoyed. Okay, as we wrap up our time together today, I have this card that I made, I think it was last week. You can see it has these shiny circles on the front, and I drew a heart. And on the back, something that I always want you all to remember, which is that you are loved and you are capable. I would love for you guys to consider subscribing if you're not already subscribed. I put out new videos twice a week pretty consistently with different kinds of classic triggers and satin gloves and some meditation elements and cardboard and books and all that stuff. So anyway, please like this video and leave a comment below letting me know what you think about these new gloves. Huge thank you to the viewer who purchased these for me. I am such a huge fan and I thought they would be interesting to explore, but like they're even more, but they're even more beautiful and interesting than I thought they would be. Anyway, that's all for now, and I really appreciate you guys being here. I'll see you next time. Bye for now. Bye-bye.